Hi guys, today I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to create original quality ranking content for e-commerce stores or in your affiliate store. Uh, this method can be extended to any other type of content creation actually. So what I will be doing is be taking a random product from here and creating content out of it. Uh, this is actually the, the Argos website. Um, so to get started, I've created a dummy page. This is my Prompt Muse new store for selling and buying um, furniture. Um, so to get started, we're going to be using a fabulous program that uh, I've, I wrote about previously, actually. But I want to start doing a series of tutorials, and that is Kateb. Um, and we're going to be using a function of theirs, Credible Writer. Uh, what makes this difference to uh, all the other AI tools is basically an issue that happens with a lot of AI tools is it makes things up. Uh, the information that the out, uh, is in the output, the, uh, the results of the AI writing cannot be fully trusted because a lot of the numbers, stats, date, figures, prices, specifications, a lot of it is just gibberish. Uh, this is what Kateb stands out. Um, a, there or their other templates for long form content is fact checked. Uh, so you don't have so much of an issue with uh, it making things up. But more specifically, what we have here on with Credible Writer is we can ask the AI to do certain instructions, but only use one URL as a source. Obviously, you can also use other things like PDFs and docs if you parse them and give them a URL. Uh, but for this, we're just going to be using it as a normal standalone standalone URL, uh, and we're going to be making our content from the Argos catalog. So as mentioned, this is the website I made just for the demo purpose. Um, and I've created a product page using advanced custom fields. Uh, if you want me to go into details on how I did that, uh, we can do that for another tutorial. Let me know down below. But for this case, we're just going to be doing product descriptions, uh, specifications, and here's one I made earlier. So we got original content here uh, about the product, information, a table, FAQ, and even client reviews. Um, so I'm going to show how I made all of that out of the Argus catalog. Uh, so let's pick up, to get started, let's pick a random, I don't know, what, what would we, let's have a look at the beds. So you could do this with any product. So let's start by taking these pictures uh, from my new website. Uh, I don't recommend stealing pictures from websites. Uh, this is just for demo purpose. Um, so make sure that the images that you use, you have the rights to use them. A few moments later. All right, so first thing we need to do is take the URL of the web page that we're working from and then go over to Kateb and put it in there. So what we want first is a description. So we want it to, so you get the command here, write a happy uh, product description. So turn the voice and what it's doing. Um, yeah, I, I found if you do enthusiastic, it starts throwing in words like, well, hey, and all that. So we'll stick with happy. Write a happy product description, and we want it to be a paragraph. There we go. Uh, the product is an ideal choice for a smaller bedroom, providing classic style. Perfect. Uh, so let's take that and put it over to our new product page. There we done. Description done. Um, now we want a table. So, so what I did here is we can take this information, which is they've done as a listicle, and we're gonna make this into a table. I've actually used another program for this. So this is Create AI. Uh, they have a uh, thing similar to Jarvis, uh, where you can just tell the AI what you want it to do. So, and it can, it will just, it's like magic, it will just provide it back. So create a two column, HTML table with this information. Just paste that in there. C 
create. And there we go. Uh, single bed mattress. So that one looks better because it's got the headings. So let's take that and we'll paste that in here. Voila. Uh, FAQ. So we're going to go back over to Kateb and we're going to say, using that URL again, um, product FAQ. And we're going to change that over to FAQ. And we want this to do, let's do three variations. It will give us some duplicates, uh, but we will delete them. Super. Uh, okay, what is, how big is the bed? Does it come with a mattress? Is it suitable for adult use? Are there any other products in Brooklyn collection? These are quite good. Uh, what is a Brooklyn bed made of? Is there a ladder? No duplicates yet. All right, one duplicate. Awesome. So let's take that and put that over into our product list. Uh, let's neaten this up a bit by highlighting the questions and making them bold. Okay, and now onto product benefits. We're going to need at least five of these uh, and they're to have titles. So let's do product benefits with subheadings. It would help if I could type. And uh, maximum variations and paragraph. And let's r run that a few times to see what we get. Awesome. So let's just paste this in, copy that, bring it over. Paste it, do a space, make that a heading, and then add an image. Uh, when adding images, make sure that you use the alt tag um, as the product title for as the keyword for SEO purposes. And done. And then just do that to the other couple, and then we can move on to reviews. For the review, uh, we want it to be first person. Customer review positive. And let's generate that. With the reviews, I noticed that it does repeat the start. So the way to get around that is just delete the first sentence. These are kind of similar. Uh, and let's delete that one. And then all we need to do is copy that and paste it into our reviews. And then put it in bracket, uh, quotation marks and give it a customer name. Obviously I don't advise on doing fake reviews, but this is one way to do it if you did want to do it. And that's it. Now we simply save and preview. And there we go. Our five minute product page is complete. Specifications, FAQ, we have our reviews. Um, I ran that through Market Muse. Uh, it got a 36 out of 36, which actually beat the Argos one. Argos got 32. Uh, and if we're comparing it to all the other companies that go after this keyword, we are beating nearly all of them, apart from this one website, which is knocking it out of the park. I did a plagiarism check, 94% unique. Uh, the six percent is kind of expected because you're talking about a product, so things like titles and stuff are going to be similar. And then I ran it through an AI writing detector, and it says it's one hundred percent generated by humans. Awesome. And that's it. That's how you create your one hundred percent original, non-plagiarized, one hundred percent human-written SEO-focused product page contents in under ten minutes. Any questions or tutorial ideas, feel free to comment below and uh, take care.